What's up guys? Well this fire burned down and we're gonna attempt some pizza pudge pies. See how that turns out. All right, so I got my supplies here. This is my pyre and it's a Rome. I bought a cheaper one. Don't do it, get the Rome. This is the double pyre iron. I like it. Let me see how this works. Uh, I'm gonna be using a little bit different than I've seen done before. I'm going with the dough sheet and I'll see how this happens. All right, here we go. Here's the iron, right like that. See how this works out. I've got some parquet butter spray to coat with. Good, generous coating. And then we're gonna open these. These are, like I said before, these are the sheets. I figure this would work better with this being the hot iron. So. And the cam's gonna pop. Will it scare me? Nope, didn't pop. Here we go. Let's see what we got going on right here. So this is a sheet. Like this is a, look at that. That's gonna work out perfect. Oh yeah. Yep, these cookie sheets, I'm gonna say, are the go-to. Doing this looks about like that much. Let me get my trusty rusty pocket knife out. And let's cut it. More like rip it. Oh yeah. All right, so we gotta do that times two. Got a little black on it from my sheet. Cut into this one a little too much. Let's just riff it. It ain't gotta be perfect, right? This is camping food, right? Have that thick crust over there, boy. Need thick crust on that side, which I'm okay with. I've got some more, so I don't know what to do with it. I feel like if I had a little bit more preparations, this would have worked out a little better. But I'll just take this and spread it out there where I rip through a little bit. We're not going for perfection here, All right, guys? All right. So after I got that, shake this up. Ragu. Traditional style. Yeah. Should have prepped this a little better. But we fly by the seat of our pants here. And I felt like doing the pudge pie. Pizza. You think cheese first or pepperonis? Or salsa? No, I don't know. Might be a little much salsa. I'm okay with it though. Spread it around. I wouldn't say a little much. I'd say perfect. I washed my hands yesterday. <clears throat> Throw the plastic in the fire. Because that's how we roll. Now, for my pepperonis, let's go heavy on them. I just want to see how this turns out, guys. Are you really doing it? If you're not sneaking a pepperoni? I like it. I think that's gangster. Didn't have any 
mozzarella cheese. I got some pepper jack shredded. <clears throat> I'll throw that into the fire because I'll cook over it here in a second. Come on, I'm strong, man. My hands are greasy. All right. Fuck it. We'll dump it. I feel like a lot of cheese. Like, I'm pretty sure I've never been like, that's too much cheese. I've just kind of always been game for the cheese. I'm going to say this would be a serving for probably you and your girl, or you and your man, if that's what you're into. I don't, I don't know. We don't judge here. No pepperoni. I feel like I can do a little bit more on the pepperonis. <clears throat> I feel like this is going to be a delicious treat. What do you think? A little more pizza sauce? Might as well, right? We got it everywhere. All right, let's put this bad boy together. Please stay in, please stay in, please stay in, please stay in. Oh yeah. She sat down perfect. Little bit of crust sticking out. Just cause I don't like burnt dough, which I might burn this completely. I don't know. All right, let's put this bad boy in the fire and see how it is. I'm gonna set it right here. Right like that for now. Probably throw some more wood on it. We'll see how she goes. I'm sure this will cook pretty fast. We'll give a time on how long I'm gonna do. 612. But I'm cooking direct. I can't get it down in there very well with the, uh, the way this rock crusher ring is. Which, by the way, rock crusher rings will make a great fire pit. Now, while I'm waiting, as Steve Walls would say, it's time for a delicious step two. <sighs> delicious natural light. I'm thinking the key to this is just gonna be to rotate it a lot. Uh, I wish my fire wasn't so hot, but we're dealing with what we got here, boys. Let's give her the old picaroni here. Oh, I would say that is, that is, oh yeah. That is coming along fantastic. Wonder what the other side looks like. Oh, hell yeah. Yep, this is going to be my go-to. I can see me doing a lot more of these. I'm going to try a bunch of different recipes. I bet I can make tacos in it. All right, I have flipped this multiple times. Just coming over and giving her an old twist. And I think this is going to be amazing. It's a little hot. Oh yeah, I'm rolling with that. Oh yeah, that side right there is perfect. It's been about 12 minutes. Ow. Rotating a lot. I'm going to let this sit because I think it'll cool, or I'll let it cool off and cook a little bit because that's cast iron, so it'll still do a little bit of cooking. And I'm probably going to drink a beer and just enjoy the creek. 
and then I'm gonna be ready to have this bad boy just because mainly now just out of pure curiosity I'm gonna see could I do because if I have about that much left over out of two of them I mean lady you're camping can I make some redneck pizza rolls and I honestly think I can so I'm gonna put some cheese on that maybe a little bit of pizza sauce and I'm gonna put them in there and wrap them up like a pizza roll and see just how it rolls here we go I've let it sit for half a beer about however long that is Woo! look at that but then I'm gonna turn right around put that down spritz this up my spritzer's almost done spritzing then like I said we're just gonna give these a shot Oh, that was a smooth transition right there. Come on. Come on. Now we'll try these. All right, let's cut into it. Oh, yeah. gonna be delicious oh yeah this will be hard to do with one hand but fudge pie pizza We're hot. We're hot. Let it cool down longer. It acts like a hot pocket. It's hot. What do you think? That's the way to go. But like, I don't want to say I'm in love, but like, I'm in love. Ma'am. that turned out amazing y'all probably wouldn't like it though because it's delicious i mean how can you go wrong with that on a camping trip relatively no mess i mean i if i didn't even want a plate i could have done it all aluminum full that crescent roll sheet this way to go though and i think make sure you overlap your edges a little more but man that's like perfect perfect so i'm just waiting on my redneck pizza rolls to finish so i guess the big takeaway from this is whenever you put whatever you're using in your pie iron make sure that when you close it it seals around it makes like a gasket of love to keep that flavor in i feel like that's the key i feel like everywhere where i had the gasket of love was delicious the whole thing was delicious but it was like sealed up no drip you could hold it that double room pie iron that uh that was hardy that was really hardy uh i feel like if we're camping me and her one of those i'd probably just take some pepperonis and some cheese in a bag together one of them rolls the crescent roll sheets roll things it's like a dollar and uh some butter packets if you could get some from a restaurant take with you put in the pie and i think that would be sweet if you're going minimalist like i'm going to take the four wheeler back out on a trip or something i think that'll be the way to go super pumped i'm ready to try these uh little delicious redneck pizza rolls and it got me thinking like 
you could do that with like you could do that same thing this is what i'm gonna try next i think if y'all want to see it the same thing but i'm gonna next time i you know cook chicken i'm gonna cut some pieces up and i'm gonna get those same cookie sheet those same sheets and i'm gonna use alfredo sauce with the chicken why not i mean let's try it now before we're in the woods right so that's that's what i'm gonna do oh yeah these are definitely doable they're very hot they uh yeah i got to drinking a beer and forgot about these a little bit but delicious i think a little bit more <clears throat> a little bit more playing with these <clears throat> and these would be delicious anyways i'm gonna drink me a couple beers enjoy this creek and uh as usual like comment and subscribe man leave me a comment i love your comments i like to know what, what y'all want to see y'all got something crazy you want me to try to chef up i'm down for the challenge with my pudge pie but yeah like comment subscribe guys deuces